Hi, this is Dan Schreiber talking to you about technical leadership. Today we're going to talk about multitasking. There's a myth that many people still believe that you can do more than one thing at once. It continues to be shown that humans can only do one thing at a time. People think they're multitasking. The reality is they're really only switching between two different tasks and doing each of them badly. Now, as a technical leader, you're being pulled in more and more different directions every day. You have more and more priorities. There are many, many urgent things for you to be spending your time on. And there appears to be no end in sight to these urgent requests. It's tempting to think that you can do more than one thing at once. Please don't fall into that trap. Although you're human, you're an awful lot like a CPU core. You can only do one thing at once. And just, you may try and trick yourself into believing you can multitask, when what you're really doing is no different than a modern operating system. You're context switching between task one and task two. And the reality is computers are way better at this sort of time slicing than we are. The costs of context switching between one thing and another are astronomical for the human brain. It's not easy for you to stop doing one thing and start doing another. You might believe there are tasks you can tune for the purpose of multitasking. The one that I see folks try constantly is checking email while they're on a conference call. All it really takes is someone to say, so Dan, what do you think about that question on a conference call when I'm checking my email? For it to become abundantly clear that I wasn't doing two things at once. I was only doing my email. And I need to say, could you repeat the question? Because I wasn't actively listening. We do this more openly in some circumstances. We have this unconscious habit of maybe pulling out our phone to check our email or to check messages. Maybe we have an unconscious habit of bringing our laptop to meetings and checking our email while we're in meetings. Your company culture may actually allow you to feel good about this because others are doing it. And you can say, I can get away with that because I see other people do it. Being able to get away with it doesn't mean that you're being productive. And it certainly doesn't mean that you're multitasking effectively. Again, how often do you feel called on the carpet when you're in a meeting and you've got your laptop open and you need to contribute but you haven't been paying attention and you need to have folks catch you up on the conversation that you've been sitting in when the reality is you've been doing something else and all you've been doing really is doing it inside the meeting room. You haven't been contributing to the meeting. We have many of these kinds of unconscious habits in our day to day. We may feel like they expend very little energy. You may drive to work on autopilot and not feel like that takes a lot of mental capacity. In the same way, you might feel like checking your phone or checking your desktop. These are not things that take a lot of effort. And the reality is, if you look at your phone and you see a new message and you read the email and you realize that you want to respond to that email, all in this unconscious habit in the middle of a meeting, or worse, a one-on-one -on -one conversation, you've just done damage to that conversation because you've context switched. You're outside of the conversation, you're now in a second conversation on email, and the person you were talking to is now totally disenfranchised. Or the meeting that you were in no longer has the benefit of you actively listening and contributing. Don't kid yourself that you can multitask. You can't. Don't let unconscious habits interrupt you and spin up a new process that you didn't realize you were even going to start. Set aside the distractions, set aside the phone, set aside the laptop, focus on the most important task at hand, and be sure that you're giving 100% to that task without trying to do two things at once and potentially just doing them both badly.